over 100 child sexual abuse lawsuits and priests removed from ministry. The Catholic Diocese of Ogdensburg is trying to recover from abuse within its churches. We've addressed allegations of abuse responsibly and justly when they've been raised. But this hasn't been enough. The diocese filing for Chapter 11 on Monday, a form of bankruptcy, hoping to receive more resources to quickly address abuse claims. Dealing with these lawsuits one at a time is extremely time consuming. It's very expensive and would require years and years of court involvement. According to the diocese legal team, these abuse cases are spread across the nearly 100 parishes under the diocese, making this a massive regional issue that likely won't go away anytime soon. In the very near future, we expect that Judge Radel will be setting a, a deadline for the filing of claims in the case so that survivors and other creditors in the case may lodge their claims with the bankruptcy court. We also will be asking Judge Radel to refer the key disputes in this case to mediation. But will this be enough for the victims? The diocese thinks so. The overriding concern in filing this Chapter 11 case is certainly not to silence victims. This is the most fair and equitable way to give treatment, to give consideration to all survivors within, within the bounds of the resources that the diocese has. The Chapter 11 filing will allow the diocese to function as normal although court proceedings have already begun. Reporting from Watertown, I'm Isabella Colello.